hi. You can perfectly add branding to your uh, to your signing page, and I will show you here how you can do that. In the first step, you have to create a new branding, as you can see right here. So you just click create new branding. You give your branding a name, uh, and then you can also provide a URL for the logo. So this has to be the uh, um, the URL to the picture directly. So, uh, for instance, it can be on your uh, picture from your website, or it, as you can see over here, it's a picture that's stored in Salesforce, uh, but you, you can put that uh, picture everywhere. Um, then you have a title. So, for instance, uh, Rhino Cars in this case, you can have the title of your company if you want. And then you can set uh, uh, specific colors for the header bar, the uh, the text in the header bar, the uh, primary buttons. Uh, the primary button would be the button over here. That's a primary button. The secondary button is this button over here. Um, as you can see, you can set those colors as well. So when that is when that is done, then you now have to, of course, indicate to your sign request template that you want to use this branding. So now in your sign request template, there is a drop down for all the brandings you ha uh, we have, and in this branding you can say the br you can select the branding that you would need. Just simply save your uh, sign request template and use your sign request template for the rest of the configuration to make sure that it's used. Now, when the sign request template is used, you, uh, when the signing page opens, you will see that branding information is used immediately. This is the logo. This is the text Rhino cars that I uh, used. You can see the header bar is a different color. Um, you can see that the, the text here is in white. You can see my primary buttons are in green and my uh, secondary buttons are in gray.